All right, wonderful people who love us of freedom. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening to each and every one of you. Welcome back to Let's Talk TV, your one and only YouTube platform. Where they're giving a back to back update on how things they be, on how things they shell for Biafra land and beyond. If you're joining us for the first time, remember to subscribe and turn on your notifications too. Make sure they be among the first set of people where they get our news anytime where we drop on Bojo. You too go get the notification for your phone so long as say your data they on. Also remember to like and share this news too. My people are see the hot where we're now, so we go they drop on phone now anytime, any day. And the latest one be say, <laughs> my people, you know the latest AVG squad where they don't create for emo. My people, you don't reach the extent where ESM members we go join them. Yes, the latest is that the ESM members join. They have former ESM members rather that joined them and they at that particular point they have dead and they have uh, come out and said that they are daring the Biafra Liberation Army yes they are daring Simon Eba and they blow hot at Simon Eba say a whole lot of things about Simon Eba and uh, his Biafra Liberation Army saying that they will gun every single one of them down if they find them in any area in uh, Imo State uh, this is the recent uh, recruit. These are the recent recruits of uh, the Hope Ozo Danger. Yes, in uh, Imo State. And this is what they are saying. They are already raging war against uh, the PMBRGIE. Say that they will be able to hit each and every one of them down if they try them. And at this point, it will just let you understand that uh, whatever it is these people are about to do, whatever it is that these people think they would be able to do, is not something that uh, would be worthwhile. It would be something that they would fail from. <laughs> They think that they will be able to go down or take down whatever it is the PM has with uh, the, the Biafra Liberation Army. But of course, none of these things would be possible because uh, the PM and the Biafra Liberation Army are on another level. Yes, the ESN think that uh, the former ESN members think they will be able to bring down this set of people. But of course, it is a joke upon jokes. Of course, uh, they are joking with themselves. They would not even be able to come so close to even do anything worthwhile to to the Biafra Liberation Army. And that is one thing they do not understand. They feel that uh, they, are, they are going to be able to do whatever it is without remembering, without having in mind that Chukwo Kike is with uh, the Biafra Liberation Army, is with the Biafra people, is with the, is with the movement. And anything that concerns the movement's positivity and the movement, the Biafra movement uh, referendum is one way or another blessed by Chuko Kike. And we are going to succeed no matter what. And so these people that think, I know that at this point they feel that they know all the strategies or they are able to anticipate the strategies of the Biafra Liberation Army. And that is why they have the mouth to come out and talk anyhow and talk to the PM Simon Ewa saying that uh, they are daring them uh, to a face-to-face. -face. And people, it is not going to end as well as they think it will end. But of course, it's going to end the bad way for them. But the right way for the PMVLA. And uh, that is the truth of the matter. Whatever it is, they think that they will be able to accomplish their in way over their heads, went over their heads, and uh, it's going to be a terrible thing for them. But of course, they don't know this because they think they are on the right side and that they are going to make the impact they expect that they would make. It is going to be a terrible thing for them and it is going to be horrible. Nothing. I repeat, nothing is going to stop them. It's going to stop uh, the, the, the Biafra Liberation Army from taking each and every one of them down. Yeah, as they've just made this particular talk. <laughs> of course, they will call the, the, this would call the attention of the highest commanders of the Biafra Army. Let's not even talk about what uh, Commander Ross would do <laughs> when he hears that this is what this set of people are doing. But we all know how Commander Ross doesn't care and does not give, does not care about what anybody would say, and he would go with his set to take down whoever it is, or uh, what uh, Commander Gentle and Commander Holy Ghost and the highest commander in the Biafra Army. My people, it is going to be tough. Uh, <laughs> of course, it's going to be tough, but not for us. We are going to accomplish. We are going to be successful. Everything we put our hands into is going to be worthwhile. And that is one thing these people do not have in mind. That is one thing they do not know. 
that uh, whatever it is that happens at this point is not going to be against us it's going to be for us and uh, we are going to succeed in everything we decide to put our hands in stop the fight right now we need to keep going further and further into it because of course that is what is expected of us so if there is anything you have in mind or that you think that cannot take place my people it's everything you think that cannot happen can happen the fact that you are even thinking that it cannot happen is what makes it possible to happen and that fact is the truth you cannot dispute the fact that uh, people are ready to do a whole lot their friends in particular are ready to do a whole lot to do to get what we want that the uh, mazenam de Kano is in custody these people thought that we'll be able to step down or to stop us from going someone else came up and took up from where he stopped and is still fighting for our rights and for what we want at this particular point and people are following him and that is what matters he has followers and of course he does not have followers because people are looking for it to follow he has followers because he has proven to have what we need in our minds to actually look look, look out for what your friends Ndibo need for the need Ndibo are looking for and he has looked out for that and he has been going for that and so because of that people have seen him as a real leader pm maze simon Epa, njoko he has done the greatest he has been doing and of course he will be respected anytime anytime any day he will be respected no matter what happens he will always be respected because of the fact that he has taken over he is someone that is doing what uh, people are expecting him to do and not standing there and making all talks maze simon Eba is someone that goes with anything I say is what I will do. If I'm saying that we'll go ahead and make sure that these people suffer for what they've done to us, they will indeed suffer. If you are going to go against what these people have been doing to Ndi Bokan, it means that surely, surely we'll go against them. If he says he's going to expose the truth about what they've been doing in government, my people, we have seen him do expose it and let us know that this is what these people have truly been doing. So he is a man of his words and that gives hope and trust to him, and which is what he has used to gain a whole lot of trust from Ndibo. And he will always have that trust. So far as he keeps on doing what is expected of him, he keeps on pushing for the for the movement of Biafran. I do not think any Biafran in his right senses will look at him and will decide not to follow him till the end. Because of course, he is doing what we want him to do. He is doing the expected thing we want him to do. He's doing, he's going, he's doing what a whole lot of us. He's coming out. You know, my people will come out, some people come out and say, Why is he why is he in Finland? He should come back to Nigeria and do it. Mazen Nam the Kano was not even anywhere close to Nigeria and they went to find him. Aligned with some betrayers that were in Kenya and brought him back because he was fighting for what was real. And you think that for someone like him now they are not looking for ways to arrest him just because of the fact that he has been doing a whole lot of things that concern the movement. The movement, the the the, the, the movement that is expected of every single one of us. Of course, so of course he is not even supposed to be seen. I do not support that Mazi Simon Eba should be seen. He should not be seen. He should not even be brought close to the Nigerian uh, uh, army or anything of that. Or he should even come back to do anything. No. He, should, he doesn't need to do that because the only thing they would want to do is to do the same thing they, done, they did to uh, 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 Mazi Namdekano. Keep him caged without, without, uh, without any real reason why they kept him there. Even without it, all the acquitted this scene of uh, Mazes and uh, Kano. They've not to release him. What do you now think they will do to Simon Eba if they get him? And so that is the one of the main reasons why if people are saying he should come back, he should come back, he should come back. No. It is not possible. He is not going to come back. Because we know your plans. The plans where what you've been trying to do, the plans of what you've been trying to 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 find him and detain him it is not going to work out and so because of this the main reason the main things that are expected right now as we're talking to you is that he is not going to stop fighting for the rights of Biafrans.
for the right of Biafrans is what we need. The fact that we need our places corner, the fact that we need a, a referendum, we want to be on our own, avoiding this set of people that are not interested in our progress or interested in anything that concerns us positively, but want to use us, want to use our lucrativeness to, to power up themselves and everything concerning them. No, 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 no. It is not going to happen. And so with the resources we have, we are going to get what we want and we are not going to be stopped by any single person that wants to so yes my people this is it this is where we come to the end of this particular broadcast thank you for joining us remember to subscribe and turn on your notifications too thank you